need to know and my name is Bodex. Guess the person we have on the show today. Yeah. He has plenty awards. Woohoo! He's the craziest man in Nigeria. Yeah. The best presenter. Hey. I'm sure you can you can feel the voice. Now give me a word though. And the person is. <laughs> no, take that. There's one award that you're going to take away from the accolades okay. that you gave me. Which Best one? presenter, sweetheart, I've given it to you. Okay. Babe, sign sealed and delivered. Stamp of approval. Boom. Where's the award? This is the award. <laughs> but I'll be this you. one. Thank no, it's this one. This is the award. Share, 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 share. Oh. <laughs> they really, how are you? I am on fire. Call 911 or Remy. I can say. I know how long you have been, you know. We've been on this back and forth, back and forth, but now yes. I'm finally here, so that's what matters the most. For real? Yes, so. You're fully back. I'm How here you with right? you, sitting with you now. <laughs> eh, we're sure, Remy. Did we plan it? Did we fight with a tiger I today? Wonder. See our jeans, so. Yes. I'm feeling your ginger. So, my friend, what has been happening to you? Plenty of my dear good things, as always, you know, in as much as you know it, with this sort of industry we're in how things can be crazy how things can be happening one minute yes. and everything slows down the next for me it hasn't slowed down at all i've always been you know on the road ah, here there here and there so i like to say life is looking good yes and I as today see. here as i can't here with you my african queen imagine my oblation cream i want eh, i don't my yellow <laughs> i want your black is selling yes thank it's you selling well daily ha. Please tell us. Yes. When did you tell yourself that you can be this crazy? When? I always thought I was going to do music. Oh. And then later on, you know, um, I noticed that I could lie myself out of any situation. Wow. Then I remember the game when we were still in, I think, primary five or so. The finest girl in our class. Her name was Yomi Daudu. I have looked for this girl. Just if you are now. watching, me only. I'm saying Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Either she's changed her name or I don't know. It was until we got into primary six that we now did okay. a school play. We interpreted a role from our, you know, Macmillan. Yes. Uh, yes Primary six. Book, Which yeah. one was it? Agbo goes to school. No, Agbo goes to school was primary four. I can't remember primary six. Wow. And there was a play in it that we now performed for the school, and I loved it. And from GSS one, I said to myself, you know what? I think I am going to go the route of entertainment, but I didn't know how. Okay. Until I got into SS one, the first opportunity ever, and it was one of the greatest ever to ever happen to me. Oh. I got the opportunity to be on Kid Vision One Hundred One. Oh. Which was on NC Network, if you remember. Yeah. Were you born then? It is time for Kid Vision 101. But the exam suspects him. Let me see your passport. Let me see your passport. <laughs> so I went for the auditioning with a cousin. Okay. My cousin called me. Wow. Only for us to get there, my cousin didn't get the role. Though. It was now me they gave the role. It, uh, we got, I was making noise. And we, that was NTA in VI. Okay. And then the producer was like, Who is this boy? Shut up! And I said, No, I'm not shutting up. Yes. And long story short, they gave me a script to read i read it flawlessly Imagine. and the woman was like everybody go home i found my character my cousin just eyed me my cousin no, left me they were no me they were no motto by shark bodied molwe their molwe was from um when you standing in that molwe i stood though i'm with a man here so gone by him jesus we just said i'll just keep a straight face <laughs> And it must be smelly. I can't After all the Yugos that we took during school. <laughs> so from then on, I think Kid Division 101 opened my eyes to the you know the um, job of production okay, and it's okay. intense work. But okay. you know a lot of people will just see the finished product. Like now, now we're doing this interview now. Yes. They will see the finished product, they will not know the wala you went through yes, to imagine. put it together. Put it together. Uh -huh. Yes. So Kid Division 101 was a brilliant start. It kick started everything for me. Okay. Okay. I was even on the cover of TV Guide. Oh. If you remember TV Guide, just like we have the TV Guide, TV yes. Guide, and they put veteran kid actor. They really say, ah, oh we'll shit. We'll so make it. from then on, now yeah, I'm sitting right. with you. Shall she arrive me? At least there. Ashi, yeah. Ashi, well, no, no. Or like people like us. Maybe you are you're there. You're still looking you have, up. You have her eyes. Okay, tell us about your dressing. Why my this? Who do I want to say about this one? Yes. I Why copied you, you now. You are my inspiration. No, I'm the one copying, you know. You are. Uh, what are she you know, my clothes are just like an extension no, no, of my person. Too. Your shoes, your trousers, your tops. And then the even way this you wear them. No, we still come to that. You come to this one. Yes. <laughs> so tell me, who inspired you? My sense of style is, you know, like an extension of my individuality. It's just me. Yes. This everything is always making noise. I mean, yes. I can't even go and steal. Oh, Timber Lodge, I don't like this. I see my hair over this one. Oh, no, no, yeah, let's cut it. Ah, oh, I leave the cut off. We'll throw it to the back. Okay, hair. it's better. Yes. So, do you normally buy them like this? Yes, or I have. Make it. Would I say buy? I think everything I have on right now is free. Except for my hair. Please. Yes, so. Who does the giving? This jacket's of... very free. Who does the free? Thanks job? to Remy Buttons. Oh. This was also free from someone from the US. 
this was free from a very good friend of mine, Michael from the US. The jeans, the jeans actually for my sister. You see, my sisters are like you, very curvaceous. Mm, okay. So once they wear and it does not fit, they just oh, throw it to like back. Okay. And then the boots, free as well. Yes. The left pair came in January, the right one came in March. I had to wait. I had to wait. I had to be patient. What happened? Me, Omo. Hey, but how did you it's get this? How do you normally get them? They were this particular pair. Okay. I would say like, um, wonderful gift okay. from somebody I hold very close, my late friend Goldie. Oh. Now she wanted to get me something special for my birthday, okay. but she didn't know what to get me, and she knew I won't always. You know, light. I always lost it after shoes like this. Yes. So this first pair, she ordered it in January. It came. Then the second pair, she now waited till like April, and my birthday is in June. Mm. She now hid it under her bed. Everything arrived in May, uh. and then she put it together and now brought it to me in June. Ha! Uh. I wanted to yeah, wear it. That's nice. Do you still pay for her? Of course I do. Yes, I mean, do. her music lives on, her legacy lives on. Yes. You know, a lot of people in the industry think, or maybe people generally think, I'm trying to replace her. I'm trying to get. You know, I always say it. Nobody can replace Goldie. Exactly. Goldie is my personal person. Imagine. She's here. Oh, can I come to see her? Oh, please. Eh? Goldie, please. Eh? Rest in peace. Don't be here. <laughs> we, don't want to, we don't want to go yet. Okay. We'll come Goldie, at the right yeah. time. Okay, 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 bye. My hair. Yes. Why do you? This particular hair. hairstyle. Yeah. yeah. Uh, do you want no, that? No, just one? this one. Jeez. Yeah. No, just. Yeah. Oh, why? Yeah. You okay, take... sorry. Oh, why not braid your hair? Why not cut your hair? My hair, no, I will not cut my hair anytime soon. Except they give me the money to cut it. Like how will much? you pay? I don't know. I I've not put a price tag to it yet. Okay, maybe you should start thinking about it. Yes, but if they give me the money to cut it, I will. You see the gorilla? Like an African look So why did wish. you decide to braid your hair and not cut like cut. normal? This cut. particular hair, I think I've tried out every hairstyle. And everyone who knows me knows I'm very adventurous yes. and experimental. And I like to try out different things. My natural hair is, you know, inside. I've yeah. colored it all kinds of colors. From purple, red, blue, black, green. Blue, I've wear. seen them. I've My seen dear. Them. So this particular one. Now, the reason why I have this, this was made for me by um, Tiana. Tiana Styling, our so shade. In. For the AMV series, I wanted a different look, so I braided my hair in twist, in white twist. Okay. The white attachment was not enough. We ran out of it, so I put gray. We put gray, and then they tied this in a bun on my head. But when I went to the after party mode, to buy open flog, and when you're like this, yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry, I cannot see. I can't, okay, I can see now. <laughs> so, basically, I just wanted, I wanted a different color. Okay. I didn't want to color my hair, I just wanted my hair in. You know, in twists. Okay. Yeah. So, so it's just you, you like nothing. making your hair because you want to stand out. Because For you don't me, want to be normal guy. I get the point. No that was before. Okay. When I was starting out in the industry, I wanted to be different from the guy next door. I wanted to be different from everybody else. Yes. And it did work for me because I was a, you know, I was, a, would I say, an aspiring model, young, hustling, trying to make things happen. Yes. And my sense of style stood me up from everybody else. Yes. But now I do it for the fun of it already. Ah, life is short. It's very short. Come on, she will love. Short year. Okay, tell us, how do you feel when you read on the internet? Ah, how do you feel when Already you get so your life, you are anybody. Oh. Yeah, let me even buy this. Oh, you get a hug, transformer. Uh -huh. ah. back flip or gutter. So you don't feel anything? I would say you? if I was a lot younger, like especially when I was starting out in the industry and then I was in Unilag and I had like my fellow students constantly abuse me, my lecturers walk me out of class, I used to fight with conductors and drivers every day and you know taxi, if I stop a taxi they will run, where me? <laughs> I remember that my brother the bus, it was from, um, from um, Ikeja okay. to, uh, I bought it Oingbo. Going, 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 and I was going to alight at Adekunle. And the moment I just boarded the bus, everybody ran up. Where they, where they? And the conductor said, I'm showing you how to fly. Oh, yeah, pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. And it was hard to get buses then. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Mr. Fibi Munish. I'm telling But you know, back then, yeah. and then when I used to get all that sort of negative reception and criticism, it was yes. quite heavy. Because I was wondering to myself, I'm not stepping on anybody's toes. Why can't they just let me be? But yeah. now, for Remy. Hmm. Carry good. Bring it. That's why on Twitter, I've okay. seen that a lot of showbiz personalities now have started that trend. They've started oh. following it. I retweet good and bad because okay. I'm human and I can't have people saying good things about me all the time. I want okay. people to also know that I get it hot. Yes. And then when I get it hot, read and laugh. Okay. Just laugh. Be entertained. So tell us, where are you from? Ah. For them, you question your yes. Bra, bra, bra. Bra, 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 bra
I am nationality confused. You know that one. My father is from Ogun State. I be oh. Okota. I like it. So that makes me an Egba like boy. Oh, Egba okay. to the core. Okay. Then my mother now. That's the story. Hmm. Yes. My mother's father is Indian and her mom is from Mauritius. And I was born in Germany. Oh. So already tell me. Oh. Yes. Oh, bless me, Tibao. Any Germany? Any Ghana? Already, I have only really yes. green passports. Green okay. passports, which is Niger, <laughs> which means I have to queue for visa. <laughs> and, and you understand me uh, now. Do you queue for visa really? And well, we always have to go and find visas now. We have oh. to. You know, as visa they be for Nigeria. Yeah. You have she to. told me, I was going through your uh, Twitter like I think two, three weeks back. <laughs> okay. And I saw they're having a live chat or something with one. Um, Kimani, I said being gay is a tough job, okay. but somebody has to do it. Did High you, five. You, you didn't see my blog that yes. I wrote already. Who they break a heart to me? Even if somebody has to do it. Be but guess what? I didn't does say that. But they really have to do it. Oh. Okay, does that mean you are draining? Or let me, I did not state it there. Uh, if no, you can't read it no. well. Now, uh -huh. I am a sexual outlaw. In the industry, I've been labeled all sorts. I've been labeled from, you know, heterosexual to bisexual to homosexual all to metrosexual sexual. to sexual sexual to solo sexual <laughs> to asexual to animal sexual. To all to this wish, uh, okay. okay. So. What's the point now in trying to explain which of the sexuals you belong to? Okay. You just allowed ah shorting pay when you are sexual, okay. So now at this point you just ask yourself, what is the point in finding out or what's the point in answering these things? There's just an air of mystery around it. The moment I come out and say it, they will not start asking me like you are not okay. asking me so now. So you're not gay. My sister. <laughs> because let, I let me be very really sincere with you. If you look at me well, I am an open book. I don't hide anything. Okay. So if I am following one uh, man in the corner, okay. I will come out and say, eh, this, this, this is the man that I'm following. I be not so. So I'm not a, I'm not one of those people who be hiding and be covering. Now, nah, if there was somebody in the picture, as somebody said one time, they said they saw me at the airport, so so person was picking me up, and then I entered the convoy, then when I was dating someone in power, I said, ah, do you think I will hide this? I will post that picture. I'll put it on Instagram. I'll put it as okay. Bay. B A E. Oh, imagine. Look at okay, Bay. Okay, really? Yes. Let us go on a short break. We'll yes. Be right yeah, yeah, yeah. Ambo, Ambo, Ambo. Welcome back. Still on Need to Know with your crazy man. You know how it is. They relate yeah. to Baba Ed. I will get it. My father will be proud of you. Oh my His God. name is Alaba. Say Omo Baba. No, Omo Alaba Edu. Uh -huh. Okay. Omo Baba Alaba ba Edu. Edu. Okay, so tell us. Yes. If you weren't a presenter, what would you have loved to be? What would I have loved to be? Ha! If I tell you this, you'll be shocked too. Please tell me. I would have been a perfect, amazing, Passport. captivating, enchanting, and scintillating Passport. teacher. Passport. Teacher! Okay. I was because I did English education in school. Oh. Myself and Linda KJ were in class then. <laughs> So I would have been an amazing teacher because um, I had experience of teaching. I had background experience in teaching. Okay, okay. When I got out of secondary school, I wasn't up to 16 to gain admission into the okay, university. Okay. So I took up a teaching job. Okay. So I used to teach and I remember I taught for a year. At that same time, I was also doing Kid Division 101. So as a youngster, I've been hustling. Yeah. 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 And at the end of the day, I realized that, you know, teaching is such a noble profession. Okay. It's something I would have done if I wasn't doing all this. Okay. Madness, Chachandra, and Bruhaha. Okay. You, what would you have done if you weren't doing this? Uh, okay, no, baby. nurse. Nurse. Uh, okay, new something that has to do something very serious. Yes. Uh, but now we are doing this, Navi. Yes. Are we yeah, are together. Okay. Oh, dear, later. Yes. Oh, what food do you like eating? What's your favorite food? I love it for Oh. Okay. Yes. Oh. Do you go to a Ah, yes. So, ah, well, um, there was someone who invited us for the opening of a huge hotel, and then I went with Olamide. So oh, we okay. went, ah, Olamide, yeah, 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 What? I knew Olamide when he started out and when he was, um, when his business was being handled by Tony Payne. Okay. I'd known him way back and I always encouraged Same you. Same Bado. Yes, so Bado to Bado. Do you have a problem with the way he does his video and the, the video vexing or mash it and he just... Well, it's Bado's, it's Bado's mode of expression. I mean, we are not going to put sand in his gary. If that's what he's happy doing, all well and good. Because I'm a tech book, but she can't want to go. I want to look big. 
Bubu, Flojah, they come at yes, there. Eh, come at there, no. Okay, what about Ogun State? Do you go home very well? Ah, yeah, Friday and Saturday I was in Abel Okay. I had an event there and it was a very good one. Okay, yeah. so uh, what's your take on the way celebrities are being handled by others, um, radio, presenter? Because I was told that a lot of them, they pay huge money before oh, yes. they would even air their music, music and all that. And stuff. So who are the real celebrities in Nigeria? Hmm. That's the a good boys, question. Or the DJs? Because they're not making money. So what's your take I on think that? everyone is a celebrity. Everyone likes to think that they are celebrities. It's in their mindset. Oh, okay. Once you've appeared on TV once or everybody knows your name or you have a certain number of followers on Twitter oh. or on Instagram, you are a celebrity of some sort. Oh, there are even a couple of people I know that are not even on TV. But because they have this number of followers on Instagram, ah, oh. Instagram celebrity. Hey? <laughs> oh, yeah, nah. But you know, it's it's again the mindset of the individual. Mm -hmm. But who are the real celebrities? We ask ourselves. Yes. I think it's a thing of the mind. Um, for me, I don't see myself as a celebrity at all. I just okay. see myself as a regular guy. I love what I do. I love the work that I do. And okay. as long as um, I am instrumental to people's success stories, okay. that's enough for me. But do you think it's the right thing to ask an artist to pay before I can play your song? Because there is no structure in this country. Okay. Abroad is different. Even yes. we have royalties where TV stations and radio stations pay artists for these materials. I'm telling you. Where for every spin, they call it spins, for yes. every spin, you're paid, they which is what they call royalties. Okay. Niger can be draining, my sister. Wow. But we okay. survive. So if you have been, if we make you Nollywood chairman today, what hey. would you like to change about the entertainment? Aside from music, I yes. think I would even concentrate on fashion to start with. Because oh, okay. a lot of our models, aside from the exports, that's those who go abroad and do well. Okay. The ones okay. we have here are cheated like crazy. Yeah. A regular model who has like four campaigns, like maybe one of the Delta models okay. who's gotten this campaign, who's done for telecoms, cannot even boast of a car. At all. And you see all of these models who are representing brands, they're not even you know as comfortable as they can be a lot of models i know will do fashion weeks now a fashion week now you model for a designer you come out like 30 times you wear over 100 clothes and you might get ten thousand naira at the end of the day That's whereas crazy. they'll bring an international model who will charge one thousand dollars per outfit That's over two hundred thousand. see okay. and then you now wear like five clothes Jeez. see but then okay. our own niger model will wear like 20 clothes over they 30. Even beg for it. Yes, and we get 10,000 there. And then even the money, they will not be paid on time. I know a lot of people who have done a lot wow. of shows that have still been owned for um, 2013 yeah, and 14. Oh. So the modeling, the fashion industry is crazy. Fashion industry, on the other hand, is doing well, but modeling, you know, the models are not, they are relegated to the background. They are not giving the recognition that they deserve. Okay. Yes, first thing, that's what I'll put right. Okay. I'll put it right. And second one, do you have? Second one, definitely for music, we'll try and build okay. a structure where artists can get royalties. Okay. Because if you look at it now, artists rely on not only endorsements, okay. but money from shows. Yes. So if show is not coming, if you back by if you my family, Hello, wow. Nijer. If you need a family. So, what's your advice for upcoming presenters? Yeah. Or let's even say somebody that has the um, the talent, mm -hmm. but there's no opportunity for the person to be where he or she wants to be. What's your advice? To so everyone who wants to branch out, do a lot of research. Read as much as you can. Yes. Read everything Stay you can lay your hands on. Stay, yes. So not seven. liking pictures on Instagram or posting nah. selfie on flick, beauty on flick, pouting. <laughs> Like one of my friends, I was. But I think I have a problem with that. Yeah, again. Mm. Lots of artists, they just some they do that. They back top and they just. Uh, uh, they are selling they... markets or Remy, oh. and they are trying to get oh, more followers and they are getting so, more likes. They said their fans that they like it that way. They like it. Mm. That's what people want Look to see. What fans are turning us into? Uh, mm -hmm. Look at us. See you now. You have ten pages. So that uh, you people will like. You will show. snap your now. Only snap our leg. Boom. Yes. Boom. Uh -huh. Compare and contrast. Compare. Who is it better? <laughs> so tell us, you know. what's your take on bloggers? Bloggers! Ah! All my close friends are bloggers. I cannot spoil their market too. <laughs> I mean, one, when, we, when we talk of bloggers, the name Linda Ikeji comes readily to mind. Yeah. Linda was my very close friend in, in Unilag. Unilag. We're yeah. best of friends and we're in the same class. So I'm not going to, you know, spoil her market. Has she I'm, written anything about you? Well, let me be very sincere. When they send Linda's story, she does not write. <laughs> <laughs> Even her sister said that when it comes to daily release matter, Linda is very careful. Ah, and it's not something I told her no. I mean, I just, I mean, for the cause, cause of the kind of friendship we've had over yeah, the years. Yeah, because she knows well, you very she, well. Yes, so. she just okay. says daily, they're always sending me rubbish about you, but I never post these things, oh. which I am grateful for. And even all the other ones, no matter what they post, I really can't be bothered. I don't check blogs, I don't read comments. Even when I post pictures on Instagram, for the fun of it, I might read the comments on yeah. Twitter. Okay. But then I really can't be bothered. 
if you are bothered about these things, you know what they say, good publicity is good publicity, bad publicity is good publicity. Yes. No publicity at all, my sister, is bad publicity. So, Toba, sorry, Koshama, sorry, they acknowledge that you exist. Uh -huh. I be not too. Yes. Uh -huh. So, what do you do when you're free? Am I ever free? I am hardly free. But when I am free, um, you know, I try and spend time with family. Okay. You know, I like to read. Which family now? My family. Oh. How many are you guys? My, we're just three. Me, I'm the first and I have two younger sisters. Oh, really? Yeah. So, me, Ronke and Jumoke. They really they? Ronke and Jumoke. Oh, I want to shit on school. So, all that they have to do now. After masters, go and bring correct man that you must marry. If you bring rubbish, I will throw you out of the house. Why? My money can always now. Which ah. money? What <laughs> more is investment? I invested yeah, in the father of the house, yes. So, you need to do the right thing yeah. to be how much for giddy or not. It shouldn't be a stress, it has to be my stress because I've invested in those children. Oh, so, very which well. means you want to collect the money back, not really, okay. But so. it's been nice to see you know, I, I, I'm one correct person to appreciate. Okay, now if I want to get you on the show, how much yeah. would you charge me? It depends on the sort of show I'm being called for. At times, okay. they call me to come and do just red carpets. Okay. And then after doing the red carpet, they don't ask me that I might be no, the MC the arrive, you MC the show. At times, they do those things on purpose. Okay. But for the sake of the fact that I'm committed to the job and I like to do my job and do it well, oh, wow. yeah. for me, it's all about the show must go on. Not a problem. Yeah. I'll go ahead but and do it. Why did you choose to be this humble instead of, you know, we have lots of uh, arrogant presenters. I see mm. the way you greet elderly people. You go on your knees, you prostrate, ah, you do... Ah, ah, you ah, 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 oh, you still have respect. I have, my father is like in his ah, 70s. Ah, I don't... Da -da no, one call me that down. One call me that I'm to call him and show you. I think a lot of people might misinterpret okay. humility and simplicity. Okay. I'm a very simple person. Okay. I'm a regular person, like I said earlier. And I'll be proper Yoruba boy. Okay. So when I see a Agbalagba, ah! I'm a king, what that And again, I've learned over time to always greet. I don't know why we can't cultivate because we're Nigerians. Yes. Even abroad, if you're walking the streets of New York, people they subconsciously or even consciously say hi to you, like hi, or they oh, smile. Okay. A smile or just a simple hi yes. goes a yes. long way. Here in Nigeria, we are thinking about too many things. We are Everybody so tight faced. To pass why I have to work with. Kilo kimi fun a generation racing mini. Oh ha ha. Three yes. two celebrators yeah. fighting yes. on the internet. Really mm. well. Boom. Uh -huh. so that one Boom. What's the impression on, on your first? You know, again, um, the media. Uh, there's something called freedom of expression, freedom of opinion, and freedom of press. Yes. Now the press can exaggerate the stories. Yes. I'm not going to lie. Now, especially when they munch these things and put it, me yes. I will read. And if it's funny, I will laugh. And that's it. I'm not going to comment because I don't know where it started from. I don't think I was part of that journey. And I, it's not my business, really. Uh -huh. But I will just read and laugh. Okay. And then if I even see the person, I will tease the person. He will launch a lure social media. We will laugh about okay. it. But I don't think I'm one person who will put mouth. And I think there are just very few people. The only person that I, I would say that I have defended on social media because I was angry about okay. how she was being... Um, you know how she was being downgraded okay. was um, or is or used to be Karen Eagle or Big, okay. Big Brother and okay. um, Goldie. I know that Goldie matter. I know they use and play because I didn't understand why they were on a case. Wow. And now that she, even after she passed on, it was even horrible. So what do you want to tell your family? To everyone watching me right now, I mean, I always say this to everyone: yeah. always be a first-class version of yourself and yeah. not a second-class version of anybody else. Be who you are. Choose a job that you love. You never have to work a day for the rest of your life. Listen to learn. Learn to listen. And then two ways to know your personality. One, the way you behave when you have everything. Okay. And the way you manage when you have nothing. Okay. And then the industry is big enough for everyone. So if people come to you for help, try as much as you can to help. Never stop saying no. Ah, wow. People say no too much. It's, it's, ah, it's scary. The, I pay it forward. There's something called pay okay. it forward. Everybody is gifted, yeah. but some people never open their packages. Go and find your package now and open it. Up. Gift! On behalf of BodexNG.com. Yes. Oh, shit. Yes. Ah. I've been asked Holy to present communion. you this customized Bodex mug. Woohoo! Oh, sure. I He's the craziest man in Nigeria. I love you, die. The most valuable presenter. Oh, sure. He has me. plenty of awards. Hey, Miss Mushi. What is the bar? The buffet. Miss Mushi! Is that you? Eba. I will so share me. Oh. You can take shepherd inside it. Eh, shepherd so thank you. Oh. Ah, I'll share it. My love, I love you, Luz. I know I'm taller than you, but... Mwah. Mwah. 
Ah, yes, some people, my name is Adele. Some people call me Wele. Some people say it's Dewele. And I look like a horror movie and I celebrate Halloween every day. And it's a Mikino Shelley. This is BODX, Bodex TV. If you are not watching Bodex right now, whoa, and you are watching, I want to change the dial. Hey, your TV will blow, your remote will explode, and your generator will stop working. Now, Niger will do it. Now, you must light the bill. But, my people, this is Bodex. Stick with the very best entertainment, extravaganza, to bad. And it's a Mikino Shelley. Okay, Christmas tree, you are you. Bodex, Bodex. The bad change a pair, all your children will look like me. And this white hair on my head, it will grow under your armpits and your boy's cutter area. I shall be bad. Do a little bit. Take it away. Take dandruff. Ah.